Oh, what's up, Kingdom Kids? It's your girl, Yada. And I'm here with a word from our good father. Yes, your father has sent me with a word, y'all. Now, I don't know who needs this, but God said somebody need this message. So I come through to bless the kingdom, okay? Now, listen, if you're new here, hi. Welcome, welcome, welcome. We welcome you to be a part of this family. So don't leave without hitting that subscribe button. That way you never miss a video, okay? And if this message blesses you in any way, please feel free to hit the like button. And if the Holy Spirit relieves you to, don't leave without commenting or sharing a video, okay? We definitely want to share the video, guys. We want to make sure this reaches whomever the Lord intends for it to reach, amen? All right, now, family, listen, I have already prayed and blessed this space, all right? Y'all know how I get down, baby. I done prayed and welcome the Holy Spirit in and welcome the good Lord in, okay? But, Father God, we still ask that you step in and take over, Father. I am your vessel, Father God, so speak through me today and make sure this word is delivered the way that you intended. In Jesus' name, amen. All right, now, family, again, I don't know who needs this word tonight, but God said you need this thing, so I just pray that it reaches you, and I pray that it's a blessing, okay? Now, family, please remember to get the word back before God in prayer and test the spirit. But whoever this is for, this should serve as a confirmation, okay? So, guys, God is saying right now, he said, on time. Yes, your father said, on time. Now, I don't know who this is for, where you are, or what you're going through. But whoever this is for, you have been crying out. You have been praying, baby. You've been asking the Lord, when is he going to show up? When is he going to step in? Come on now, when is he going to help you out of this situation? And he said, baby, I am going to show up on time. Yes, I come with that good news today, baby. He said, y'all to tell him I am going to show up on time. And y'all, God gave me this thing so deep. Listen, when I was praying over this thing, God, I don't know where I had to use the restroom. And I'm talking about I had to go. Like, you know how that commercial say, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go right now. Like, I had to go. And I was in this park where I, I usually make my videos, right? Y'all stay with me. I promise it's gonna bless somebody. So I'm in the park and I'm like, okay, well, let me go to Burger King where I usually go. But this day, this day, God was like, no, go to McDonald's. <laughs> and so I was like, okay. So I went to McDonald's, y'all. When I pulled up to McDonald's, the van on the on side of me, on the right side of me, it said, on time service. Y'all know me, baby. I, it blessed me. It was confirmation for me for the word that God had given. So I took a photo for y'all, okay? And I'm going to upload that thing so it can bless you as well, okay? But whoever this is for, God is saying right now, he heard your cries, baby. He heard your cries and whoever you are, you have been patiently waiting. I don't know how long you've been going through. And again, I don't know what you're going through, but you have been patiently waiting. But you have been asking God, like, God, I've been waiting. When are you going to step in? Come on now, when are you going to show up? And God wants you to know, baby, he is going to show up on time. Remember, your father has never been late. Come on now, he has never been late. He said, y'all to tell him I have never been late. Now, I ain't finna store with him. Come on now, your father say he is not about to store with you. So again, I don't know who you are, but God is saying right now, he's about to pull you out of that pit. He's about to pull you out of that situation that feel like, like uh, some of you guys are in situations that feel like quicksand, feel like the harder you work, the harder you struggle in the work, you know, to come up out of that thing and you get deeper in it. God is saying, baby, I'm about to pull you up out of whatever has been holding you down or sucking you in, right? He said, I'm about to pull you up and place your feet on, on proper uh Oh, uh, solid ground, right? You're about to get that proper footing. You're about to get that stability. I don't know who you are, but God is saying some of you guys have been asking them. You'd be like, you like, God, just show me what to do, right? Just tell me what to do, Lord. God is saying right now, do not forget. Listen to me now. He said, do not forget that this is a need to know relationship. All right, you have to trust your father that when you need to know the information, he will provide. All right, God said, baby, this is a need to know relationship. This is a need to know situation. So when I know you need the information, when I know you need those directions, I will provide it. Okay, so whoever you are, God is saying right now, baby, when you need that information, I'm going to provide it. I will not, will not leave you hanging, right? God ain't going to leave you in the blind, baby. He ain't going to leave you in the blind, okay? God said, baby, do you know you serve a, a good shepherd? 
okay? He is the good shepherd. Come on now. He said, listen, whoever you are, he said you can trust he's going to show up on time in this situation, okay? God is going to come through on time. You serve an on-time God, baby. Whoever you are, wherever you are, do not forget that you serve an on-time God, baby. He is going to show up on time. Okay, he is going to show up on time. Amen. Listen, I don't know who this is word is for, but if you know this is your word, baby, come on, somebody say God is going to show up on time. Amen. He is going to show up on time. I don't know who you are, or where you are, or what you're going through. But if you know this is your word, baby, say God is going to show up on time. Come on, say that thing out loud and then go down there in the comments and type it out. Get it in your subconscious mind. So as you patiently wait, that you will continue to remind yourself that God is going to show up on time because he's an on time God. Amen. Come on, somebody say God is going to show up on time. And encourage yourself today, family. And you're going to encourage your brothers and sisters as well because as they watch the video and they see your comment, they're going to see God will show up on time. And he's not going to just show up on time for you, baby. He's going to show up on time for them as well. Amen? So go ahead and comment that thing. Say, God is going to show up on time because he is an on-time God. He is an on-time God. He has never been late. Come on now. He has never been late in Jesus' name. Listen, y'all, let me give y'all some scripture that I'm gonna let y'all go, okay? I love y'all so much, family. Again, whoever this is for, baby, I pray this thing reaches you. I pray that it blesses you, encourages you, and strengthens you, okay? And listen, y'all, this is the scripture that God led us to, okay? He led us to Psalms 40, Psalm 40, verse 1 and 2. Again, Psalms 40, verse 1 and 2. Listen, this it says, uh, I waited patiently for the Lord, and he turned to me and heard my cries. Come on now, the Lord say, I heard your cries. Come on now, you have waited patiently, and he heard your cries. I don't know who you are, but you know who you are, right? And then verse 2 says, he brought me up also out of the horrible pit, out of the miry clay, and set my feet up on a rock. Come on now. He set his feet up on a rock. That is solid ground, right? And then it says, and establish my going. Right? So God is saying right now, I'm not going to just pull you up out of that situation. I'm not going to just pull you up out of that pit. I'm not going to just pull you up out of that prison. I'm not going to just pull you up out of that situation where you may feel like you're drowning. I'm also going to place your feet on, on solid ground, right? Give you that proper footing, that stability, and I'm going to guide you. Okay, he said he is going to establish my going. This is saying I'm going to guide you. I'm going to lead you. I'm going to show you the way, All right? Remember, he is the good shepherd, baby. He is going to show you the way. So I don't know who you are or, again, what you're going through. And you're asking the Lord, when is he going to show up? You've been wondering, when is he going to show up? When is he going to step in into this situation and help you out and assist you with getting out of this pit, out of this, this um, who feel like a lose-lose situation? Thank you, Holy Spirit. But God is saying right now, baby, he is going to show up on time because he is an on-time God. Right? He is an on-time God, baby. Listen, I don't know who needed this thing today, but God said you needed it, baby. Again, this should be a confirmation. Again, some of you guys are asking the Lord, when is he going to show up? And you'd have been waiting so long. You're like, God, just show me what to do. God is saying, just wait. Continue to wait patiently. Okay? He is going to show up on time, baby. All right, listen, I love y'all so, so much, family. I really, really do, y'all. love y'all with the love of God, family. Listen, thank y'all so, so much for the love, the likes, the shares, the comments, the new subscribers. Hey, family, I see you all. Thank you all so, so much. Even the new followers on TikTok. Hi, y'all. I see you guys as well. Thank you all for joining the family and allowing me to be a part of your journey, okay? I thank you guys for uh, the sowing of seeds, for the donations, for the gifts that you guys have been sending in. I thank you for your generosity. Okay, thank you for giving into the ministry and giving into God's vision and his mission for what is he going to do uh, do here with us and do it here with us as a ministry and a family, right? So guys, I thank you and I just pray that the Lord will open the windows of heaven and pour you out a blessing that you don't have room enough to receive. Amen. It is in Jesus name that I'm praying for you guys. Okay, family. All right. Now y'all listen, y'all go out and live the blessed life. You know, the blessed life comes from first being a blessing.